happy to let's go down here and welcome to UFC Undisputed 3. Alright, so we are about to do creations right now. Um I don't know which one to pick, but um Maybe, yeah. Mu Muay Thai. Orthodox. Yeah. I'm righty. Alright. Yeah, um. So. Yeah, about that. My real name is Ricardo, but. <laughs> yeah, uh, I couldn't. I couldn't unlock uh, Suave. The nickname Suave. Hey, Chuck Liddell. So I'm on the middleweight division. Um, uh, skill test, I think. My dog is with me. <laughs> Come at me, bro. How about that? Oh. Alright. Are we going up?
Oh, that was great training right there. Alright, let's continue. Hey, um, uh, uh, you want me to tell you the story that, um, I, I, I didn't like a UFC fight at all, like the Ronda Rousey versus Holly Holm, um, yeah, I hate Holly Holm, I know she lives in my country, but if she defeated the only woman that I, I liked, uh, in the UFC. So, um, so, I hate her, like, like, too much, like, it, like, but I am glad that Misha Tate defeated her, and, and she deserved it, haha. <laughs> Alright, I should be, like, yeah, advance. Advance, yeah. He fought. Debuting in 2001, the World Fighting Alliance featured a Vegas nightclub atmosphere with some of the top talent in the mixed martial arts. Future champions like Clinton Rampage Jackson, Rich Franklin, Oh, Lyoto Machida and Quentin Rampage Jackson are my favorite. Alright, let's schedule a fight. Let's do this one. Simulate. Friday. Alright, let's do, um, camp sessions. Let's do this one. Yeah, hey, uh, Black House. Let's learn. Let's learn, let's learn the left back fist. Manual. I'm just petting my dog. He really misses his brother. Poor little thing. First time training. I was about the first six months of him being here, and I, and I saw how he was so focused on being in the gym and learning and, and being a student of the sport. This guy's going to really go places. You could see every month, six months goes, goes by, it's, very, it's a little bit different. A year later, it's very different. And they got to a point where I just couldn't submit him anymore. As long as I keep the focus on the small things, I keep getting better on a daily basis. You better stand up on a daily basis. Better 
grappling on a daily basis. So the idea is keep the focus small and, and the bigger things are going to take care of themselves. Okay. Let's fight. So, I'll see you in the fight. John has the ability to drive himself. Like, you know, really no other person that I've ever been able to see to witness do. I decided to try to walk on and wrestle in the toughest, the toughest conference um, around, which is a big town. What are you trying to by the time I graduated, he was captain of the uh, wrestling team. I started getting towards the end of my, my college career, and uh, I wasn't done, done competing. I still had that hunger, and I still felt like I was improving as an athlete. But, like, it just sucked because, though, my career's over now. That's when John decided to try his hand at mixed martial arts. My first fight was not a very smart fight to take. I fought a very tough guy at my final. I showed up. I didn't have a cup. I didn't have a mouthpiece. I didn't have a corner. I didn't even spar. The fight started and I kind of froze and I was like, oh, we're going to fight now. That's over like in two minutes. Alright, well, I will see you in the fight next time because, yeah, um, I want to upload my video really fast, so... Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.